you guys it's my welcome back to my youtube channel so today's video is gonna be a dancing with the stars live vlog if you don't know what dancing with the stars live is i'm pretty sure most of you guys know but basically it's like the show then obviously not gonna film a show it's like a concert basically you're like going to watch them dance live i hope that made sense so yeah let me do a little otd i think my outfit is so freaking cute this is my shirt I got it from Target and these are my jeans I'm in love like babe and then these are my shoes don't mind my dirty floor anyways from the Melio footwear time check is currently 301 and I'm gonna be heading there now it's like an hour drive because um, like traffic hour and whatnot and i literally also went to disneyland this morning with one of my friends that'll be in my spring break vlog so stay tuned for that i'm excited honestly but i'm freaking pissed because the reason why i bought dance with the stars tickets was for so ching vow if you this might be a spoiler so just skip one like one double tap but they're the champions for dance with the stars so like I'm confused on why they're not going. And that's literally the only reason why I bought the ticket was for them and the ticket was free and I'm not gonna say the price, but babe. The second person I'm excited to see is Riley Ronald and also Harry Drowsy, I think is what his name is. So those are the two next people that I'm excited to see, but I really want to see Silchin as well. Like, it doesn't make sense, but um, it's whatever, I guess. Um, I think it's the last show tonight, which is crazy, but don't mind my dirty room, ew. Okay, literally probably no one was paying attention to that. I literally just pointed it out. The lighting is kind of bad, but before we do go, I want to take my deep bloat gummies because I was eating pretty good at Disneyland. So, I don't even know if these work. There you go. I don't even know if these work. Yeah, I bought it like two weeks ago. I don't, I don't know if they work, but... Let's go, guys. Bye. So I want to explain how the VIP is going to be because I bought the VIP tickets. So this is for VIP. Check-in is at 4.45 to 5.15. And then the Mirrorball Trivia Showdown is 5.30 p.m. Photo ops are 6 p.m. And then the crowd-free merch shopping is after the photo op. And then doors at 7 p.m. and showtime 8 p.m. Can I get a venti strawberry side lemonade with no inclusions? And then can I get a chocolate brownie? Did you want that warm up? Uh, yeah. And then can I get two vanilla bean scones? And then can I get the cinnamon coffee cake? Sure. I was thinking about getting canes before I left to LA, but to be honest, I'm not really craving it. I was craving it like yesterday, but like, mm, I don't know because just thinking about it is making me like, like, you know? I mean, I love canes, but like, I also just had it last week. So like, I was like, should I get it like again? I was like, mm, maybe not, maybe not, you know? Because literally every time I get canes, I have to get two toast. So like, I'm like, I mm, don't feel like that. Even though I'm literally getting unhealthy food right now, I literally got three stuff. Well, four stuff, but like three food items. And also I bought parking tickets like ahead of time. And then it says like, I can only like park in there like after like 5 p.m. No, yeah, after 5 p.m. But I have to be, like I have to check in at 4.45, so I don't really know. I'll see if it works before 5 p.m. because I'll get there like at 4.15. Okay, can you scan it? I never talk. Oh no, I'm just really happy right now. I never talk to the drive through people. That's that's a little concerning. And this song is so fire. Like it's actually crazy. Go, go. And also this is my first Darby's this year. Well, my first strawberry acai lemonade with no inclusions. But I did have like a coffee from Starbucks. Anyways, yeah, this is my first refresher this year. It's such a sleigh. I'm gonna do a taste test of the food. I've already tried the vanilla bean scone. But let me try the coffee cake thingy. 
Mm. That's so good. Let me try the brownie, which I'm most excited for. Oh. Oh my god. Oh my god. So much better than La La Land, honestly. I love La La Land, but like it's not like too melted, like where the chocolate's like completely melted. Oh my god, it's not too chocolatey. Look at this traffic, bro. It's not even a joke. Okay, I'll see you guys once I get to LA. Slay. If I knew they were gonna have food right in front of the venue, I would have never got this. This is my first time ever at the Pantages. Pantages. Why would I vlog? People always look. But YouTubers, no one looks. them and talk to them but no no they're like you cannot hug them just put your arms around them like when you take the picture but you cannot hug them and they're like you cannot kiss them and i'm like i want to kiss harry harry is so freaking fine in person damn that's crazy i have 10 minutes until they let us in to take our seats so i do have to hurry actually i have eight minutes now i don't even know if i'm allowed to bring snacks in
Thursday Night Dance. Remember when we did Gangnam Style? Yeah. 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 Got perfect scores. Maybe I was the captain. I don't take all the credit. You know, we did have so cheesy stuff. It is what it is. Yeah, yeah. But ever since that dance, I've been doing research on styles of dance, which I probably should have done before the show. Oh, that helped, yeah. Yeah, yeah that's okay. So, Emma, I trust your opinion, and I trust your opinion. I want to present to you guys Gangnam Style, but in different styles of dance. Oh, okay. It doesn't matter. I'm going to go anyway. So, the first one is a paso, uh, and in my research, a good dancer needs space. So, Emma, if you're a good dancer, you understand I need to take space. Sorry, got it. Perfect. Cue the music.
ask a few questions. Dante's with a pro.
that has a bit of a story to it as well. Wait, Pasha, you forgot your table and chairs. Pasha. Oh, he's changing. Kate, you want to come and help me? I'm <laughs> just kidding, just kidding. You've delighted us long enough, okay? Bruno, maybe somebody. Oh, I can hear you. <laughs> it's okay. I, well, being from LA, I actually do know the name of a moving company in the area. I think they're called the Cha-Cha Movers. Oh, no.
What's four plus four? They ate that up, bro. Literally, it was so freaking good. I could you not? It was so beautiful. I don't know how Emma Slater. I don't know how she remembered that much lines. Like, anyways. But when I went to go meet them, Harry Jowsey was like, "How you doing, my love?" He called me his love. But do you want to know? I just found out. I just found out that I have a crush on Brandon Armstrong. Like, I never paid attention to him in the show, but in person, oh my god. I was looking at him the whole time. He's so freaking gorgeous. I can't. Let me talk to you while exiting because... Actually, I should wait because there's a lot of cars right now. And also, I thought it was going to be like everyone from the latest season. Like, even like the... What are they called? Like, the con... Con... I don't know what they're called, but you know, like Jason Mraz, uh, Harry Drowsy, and like... You know, Sochi Gomez. What are they called? Like, not the pros, but competitions? I don't know what they're called, but I thought like literally everyone from the latest season was gonna be in it, like in the live show. But Harry Jowsey was the only one that wasn't like the pro. I wonder why. Do you guys know why? Like why like they picked like Harry Jowsey to be like in the live show and not like Jason Mraz? I don't know, honestly, but I'm not complaining because Harry Jowsey is so freaking gorgeous and like fine. So the time is currently 10.39. Yeah, I'm heading home because I'm tired. Obviously I'm heading home, where am I going? To the club? No. They ate, they slayed. And also I got my pictures back that we took of the group. Here are the pictures. Okay, so I'm gonna play some Obsessed by Libby Rodrigo. I'm gonna play her Spilled Guts album. Comment down below what's your favorite song from the Guts Spilled album. To be honest, I like Obsessed. Then I like So American. Let me do a little haul right now. I was gonna wait until I go home, but I might end the video right now in the car because there's no point of waiting until I go home. So, yeah. Okay, let me do a little haul in what came with the bag. So, I got the VIP, so we all got like a little bag. It would be cute if we got like a tote bag or something. Whatever. At least it has like a dancing with the stars on it. But, so in the bag came with a poster, which is such a slave because I wanna have a collection of posters when I go to like tours. Like, literally, I have this poster wall, so this is a sleigh. Also, I took some of this. And then we also got this. I don't even know what this is. A notebook. This is Dance with the Stars VIP 2024. Such a sleigh. We got this water bottle, which is such a sleigh. I don't even drink out of water bottles like these. I just usually drink from a like, water bottle like this. But I'll put it to use. But then also, I didn't show you. Shoot, he scared me. Also, I didn't show you my little badge. It's Dance with the Stars. I think this is so cute. But I want to have a collection. Like, I want to keep getting VIP like passes so I can have like a collection of these. But you know, like Nessa Barrett, Tamer Cray, you know, all of them. Oh, I didn't even see this. <gasps> Keychain? It says the Samba Hotel. Ooh. This is cute. I think it's a keychain. Okay, then the thing that I bought is a shirt. I was gonna get a hoodie, but it didn't have the tour dates in the back, and like, every time I go to like a tour, I always want like the tour dates in the back. It's this shirt, it's such a sleigh. So cute. Yeah, that's everything I got, but I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, like, subscribe, comment down below. Um, what's your favorite Nessa Barrett's, no, not, mm, sorry. What's your favorite Olivia Rodrigo Spill Your Guts song from the album? That made no sense. And also, comment down below who is your favorite person from the latest season. My favorite is Sochi Gomez. I wish she was here. I don't know why she wasn't here. It doesn't make any sense. And also, they were so freaking beautiful. Like, all of them. Even the guys were so freaking, mm. Okay, but if you guys enjoyed this video, if you did like, subscribe, comment down below what other YouTube videos you'd like to see next. Please comment down below what other YouTube videos you'd like to see next because, yeah, I need some more recommendations here because I'm planning videos for April and May, so comment down below. But if you guys enjoyed, like, subscribe, comment down below, and I'll see you guys in my next YouTube video. Peace, love, and happiness. Bye!